Wow, that orange cleaner really worked out good. Okay, remember I just finished up this, all this baseboard, cleaning it all up. And I finished up in this closet. Doesn't that baseboard look nice? It hasn't been repainted or anything, I just cleaned it up. I rinsed it off with water first. Oops. <laughs> I rinsed it up with water first and I put that orange cleaner on there and away I went. Okay, I also did this room in here. Yeah, just spend a little bit of time and do things right. And <laughs> you probably didn't notice this before, did you? If you haven't been watching my videos, maybe you didn't realize there's a sauna, a six foot square sauna cut off at an angle right there for the door. And I've been using this, try to use this each night during this project. And I'm gonna finish up, I'm gonna do all the floors as far as I can. I'm gonna do this section last, so that once I take this down, then I'll be able to finish up the rest of this one little area. You wanna watch how that comes apart? I'll make a video of that too. Yeah, see, I think I have to pull this all apart. I've never, I didn't install it or anything, but it came on a pallet and it was put all together. They brought it in here one piece at a time, put the wall, put the floor together in one piece. The walls, boop, 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 the whole top went one piece. And so I think it's gonna be easy enough to take all apart. Time will tell though if it does. And guess what, after that, I have a feeling that once this once I get this floor all done and seal it and stain it or stain it and put two coats of sealer on here, I'm going to have to wait maybe four or five days or, or something after that. And then I'll probably take this same carpet piece. I'll put this carpet pad down uh, just loosely and the carpet there. And then I'll put this back up until this house sells. Then once the house sells, they're going to have to pull this apart again and take it with them. Not sure if there's any other way, but they really want to take this with them and I don't blame them. So now that I got all the baseboards cleaned and everything, I got one more thing to do, right? Before I do anything else now, I've got this baseboard to paint again. And I reach down here and I just kind of feel on it with my hand and it feels nice and dry. That's something. I've only been off that base maybe less than an hour. It's nice and dry. As long as you get have it dry, it doesn't have to be cured 100% before you put the next coat on. Okay, I'm looking at it and it looks pretty good actually. Like maybe it doesn't need any more paint, but I'm gonna do it anyways because it's not gonna take very long. And that way any imperfections, I do see a couple imperfections maybe Maybe uh, over there, there might be a little piece right there in that corner. And so I'll just do it because I can.